It's that time. Welcome back. When it comes to farms in Indiana, there's way more than just corn. And if you're looking for the best pumpkin farm to visit, there's only one person that we knew we had to ask. It's lifestyle and Indianapolis family expert Katie Mann from Indy with Kids to share four fall farms that you have to visit. Hi, Katie. Hi. How are you? Good. Well, there are so many farms in Indiana, so many, yeah. and I had to pick four just to make it easy. But if there's a farm near you that you want to support, I totally support that as well. So, but let me tell you about four I'm that excited. our family is visiting this year, or we've already visited a couple of them. So, uh, Lark Ranch, of course, have to mention them. Uh, what's super unique about Lark Ranch is they have this train there. That's, that's what I was on just tracks. looking at. How yeah, cool. Yeah, it's such a fun ride. It's a real train, just a smaller scale. It runs on real tracks. It goes around the cornfield, um, around the corn maze, and there's like a little ghost town that they've built out there. It's just kind of fun to see. There's really pretty flowers along the way, and all ages love it. They even have an accessible car as well for people who might need that. So. Lots and lots of fun. They How have cool carnival rides and everything is included in the cost of admission. So you go in, you can ride the rides, you can do all the farm activities, you can see the animals, uh, do the corn maze, and it's all included in that one price, except for I think pony rides and pumpkins are extra. But right. uh, a really, really fun time for the kids and they're open on weekends through October. I didn't realize how big it was. It's huge. Wow. It's really, really big. Next up, uh, Waterman's Family Farm. Love Waterman's. Waterman's. If you wanted to so stay fun. right in Indiana, Annapolis. It's right there. They actually have two locations. This is their Raymond Street location. A uh, big slide. The pumpkin eating dinosaur. You can't forget that. Yep. Hay rides. You can go pick your pumpkins. Um, a spinny uh, corn thing. Uh, <laughs> lots of those like gerbil wheel kind of things that the kids ride through. There's the spinny. There it's is. a spinny pumpkin, not spinny corn. So there's lots and lots of stuff for the kids to do. Also included in admission. And um, you're going to have this Wednesday through Sunday. So even weekdays oh, for nice. Waterman's. And if you don't want to have the hassle of the festival kind of experience, then you can go, they call it a tranquil experience on Mondays and Tuesdays, where you won't pay admission. There won't be as many activities, but you can still walk around, pick your pumpkin, and do all of that. Oh, Next up that. is another favorite of ours is Kelsey Farms. So many things to do. Another one where you pay one price and everything's included except everything's for your pumpkin in. and food. Yeah. Um, my kids love here going here. They love the corn crib, which is just this massive barn filled with corn, and they just love throwing the corn curls. They love climbing on the hay, climbing in the hay, riding the moochoo train, getting a grilled cheese sandwich is tops on the list, visiting the animals, the corn maze, the hay ride, all of that at Kelsey Farms. And they have, um, they're open on the weekends, but they also have two weeks where they're open during the week for yeah. fall break. So oh, if your kids perfect. on fall break, see if it lines up with their schedule. Well, you know families are going to be looking for things to do. They totally are during that fall break. And finally, Tuttle Orchards. If you want to do the apple picking and the pumpkin picking, you got to do that quickly because apples are, you know, Oh, yeah, We're almost but you missing can do out on both that. here at yeah. Tuttle Orchards, um, and there's no admission fee. But if you do want to participate in some of the activities, like the narrated hayride um, or the uh, the tractor town, yeah. then you will pay extra. But really great, definitely visit the farm store for both Tuttle Orchards and um, uh, Waterman's. So, so much lots fun. of fun. I just love the variety we have and the options. Katie, if people want to see your full list yes. and just all the other resources, what's the best way? IndieWithKids.com or find us on Facebook and oh, Instagram. Yeah. Katie, thank you so thank much. You. This is getting me so inspired to go out there. <laughs> thank you, thank you.